All right, so after we have done the assembling of this work, so now we want to uh, work on these questions as we are asked that we should draw a front elevation looking direction of arrow X, a plan, and two end elevations. We are doing this in press angle orthographic projection. So this is arrow X, so the object is being looked at in this direction with this, uh, this. So let's see how this work can be done. Okay, um, so what we need to do first is to draw a horizontal line. So, once we draw the front elevation, look in the direction of arrow X as we are told. So, we draw a horizontal line like this, and then we are going to uh, draw a vertical line. So, just uh, move it a little bit from the edge of the paper, and then we we'll draw a vertical line here. Okay, so now. So we are first of all going to start with this shape that we have here in the in this on uh, this part. Okay. So we have this rectangle and we also see this surface. So we have that distance from total distance is uh, 105. So this is it. So 105. Okay. And then so distance from um what do we have? Um and I want to get the distance from okay. So if we take 10, so I want to get this time from here to here. So we take 10 out of 105, that will give us one that will give us 95. Okay, so 95. But first of all, draw uh, we'll take a measurement of 105 millimeters. So 105 millimeters from here. So this is 105 from here, and then I'm coming to this side and take 10 millimeters here. Okay. So with this measurement that I've taken, then I will come here and take 25. So 25. So this is 25 millimeters here. So this is 25 millimeters. So we have uh, that. Okay. Um, then, so I'm going to draw a vertical line at this point. So where we have that 105. So we have this uh, vertical line. Okay, so at this point also I will draw a vertical line. So here like this. Then here I'm going to draw horizontal line. So that uh, it goes to both left and right because we are drawing the two end elevation. So this rectangle that we have here, so is for this rectangle, is for this rectangle, and this one that we have here is for this uh, rectangle that we have here. So we have drawn that. So another thing that we need to show here, we are going to show hidden details. So now by the time we put this one here, so this part, this point is going to be hidden from us. So it's going to be hidden from us. So we are going to uh, show that. So let's do that at once. So we have it. Uh, so from what we have here, so from this end, we have to, to take 30. And from here we have what we have 40. So we take a measurement of 30 millimeters from this end. So 30 millimeters from this end. This is 30 millimeters. Then we take 40 millimeters from there. Okay, so this is 40 millimeters. Alright, so we are going to uh, draw a vertical line. So here we draw a vertical line. So it's comes down like this and we also have it, it comes down like this all right so then uh, the depth so the depth of this part from here to here is 20 millimeters this is 20 millimeters so we are going to take that 20 so we take that 20 so this is 20 millimeters here okay so this is 20 millimeters and we are going to draw horizontal line so we draw a horizontal line to both the left and right. Okay, so uh, let's take note of that. So other thing that we are going to do here is to bring out this shape. Because by the time we insert this here, so this we enter into this, this part from here to here we enter into this. And then this is going to stand on this surface. And this time from here to here is 40 millimeters. So which we have already taken from here to here. So you just need to do this thing. So this shape, this surface, and this rectangle 
here on this part. So what I'm going to do now is that I need to uh, erect a vertical line at this point. So I've erect a vertical line at this point here. So it goes up like this. And we also have a vertical line. So we also draw a vertical line at this point here. Alright, so then um, another thing that we have there is that so this time from here to here is 45. And from here to here is 15. So from here to here is what is 15. Then coming down here is 15, and then it comes from uh, from year to year. So from year to year is 25. Okay, so we have to take that distance. So uh, which we have already. Okay, so I will take 45 millimeters up from here. So right from this point here. So we take 45 millimeters up. So this is 45. So at this point, I'm going to draw a horizontal line. So that horizontal line. We draw it to both left and right, to both left and right. So it goes like this, to the left, and it goes to the right. Okay, so we have it here. So then, another thing that I need to do, I need to take 15 millimeters, 15 millimeters from this end. So this is 15 millimeters here. So at this point, I will draw a vertical line, and that vertical line will come down to the plan. Okay, so this is the vertical line we draw like this then um so from uh this point down here we have 15 so i have to come to this end here and take 15 millimeters down so this is 15 millimeters here okay so here we draw horizontal line so to both left and right so it goes like this and it goes like this Another thing that we have here is to create this uh, rectangle that we have here. So we are told that from this end, this rectangle, the length is 15 and the width is 10. So right from here, so to start from here. So here we take what we take 10 millimeters down, 10 millimeters down. Then we are going to take 15 millimeters. So 15 millimeters. Uh, so this is 15 millimeters. So from this point, I'm going to draw a vertical line. Here, I will draw a vertical line from this point. So it comes down like this. Then, the horizontal line. So horizontal line. So it goes to both left and right like this. Alright, so everything that we need for the front elevation is already placed here. So let's bring out the thickness, uh, the uh, feasible uh, outlines and feasible edges. So uh, this will be a complete thick line from here to here. Okay. And then, so coming up here, so we have a complete thick line. So from here to here. Okay. All right. Then, um, so this will be a thick line. And this will also be a thick line. Okay. Then the hidden part. So along this line, so we are going to draw this with short dashes line. So like this. Also coming to this end here. So this will also be a hidden part. So it's short uh, dashes line. Okay, so then here also we also draw this with short dashes line. Alright, so we that's what we have there. So also this line also we also be uh, a tip line. Alright, so that's what we have on this uh, part here. That's what we have on this part here this uh, hole that is hidden in the front elevation then we come up to uh, this surface here so let's bring that, that out so this line will be a thick line from here down and then so also so this will be a thick line from here to here and then so this will be uh, a thick line so from here down and then, so we have uh, this uh, a rectangle. Okay. 
So, um, all right, so this goes down to this end here. And then, so we also make this one a thick line from here to here. All right, so this is how the front elevation will look. All right, so we have drawn the front elevation. This is the front elevation. Now, let's go for the uh, top view or the plan. So, we move that a little bit. So, then we draw horizontal line here like this. So, then uh, coming for the uh, uh, for the plan. So, distance from here to here is 45 as we have it here. So, 45 millimeters. And then we are going to break this down into 15, 15, 15. Okay, so we need to do that. So, um, so I will come here now. So I'm going to take 45 millimeters from this point. So this is 45. Then I'm going to break it down into three. So this is 15, and this is another 15. So from each of these points, we draw horizontal line. So we draw horizontal line. So to both sides. Alright, so we have done that. So the next thing that we are going to do here is to bring out the shape of the plan. So for uh, this part, so we are going to see this line in joint together. So we already have it there, just need to bring it out. So I'm connecting this point and this point together like this. Sorry, 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 sorry. So I need to be very careful with this. So uh, from here to here, so from here to here is 10, from here to here is 10, and then from here to here is also 10. So, um, okay, so it's 10. So I need to take that 10 to bring out that part. So it is not 15. So that one is 10. So I have to take 10 from here. So from here up, and then, so coming to this point, I need to take 10 down. Okay, so I now need to draw horizontal line again. So we have so many lines, so that means we need to wash full. Okay. Alright, so we have that. So what I need to do now, so to bring out the plan, so we join this together. Okay, so we also I join so this point together like this and then so we make this a thick line so this line also from here to here will be a thick line and then this line so we also make it a thick line all through and this line will also make it a thick line all through all right, so we have this. So another thing that we have here is, um, so we have this rectangle. So this rectangle is along this part. So we already have it. Then this shape that we have here, so with this rectangle, so it's around this place. So, um, okay, so that's what we have here. So I need to draw this line as a thick line. Also this line also. So we make it a thick line. <clears throat> then, um, all right. So this twenty-five. That is the distance from here to here. So we have it here, okay. And then, um, okay. So I want to see the distance from here to here. So this stuff. Okay. So the total is forty-five. Take ten out. So the menu will be thirty-five. So that 35, so I want to know where we have that 35. Okay, so we have it here. So we get to this point, and then this rectangle will come out. Okay, so that's it. So I need to make this, so draw this line like this. Okay, then I will now bring out the rectangle. So I'll bring out the rectangle. So the rectangle is along this part here. So we have that. So then 
uh, the part that is hidden so is around here like this so we need to show it very very important so for this so it will be hidden in the plan so we need to show it so we um, so we draw so these are short dashes line also so we also draw this Alright, so this is how the plan, this is how the plan looks as simple as I've done it here. So, um, alright, so this is the plan, so this is how it will look. So, let's meet for uh, a video on the uh, edge to ends elevation. Thank you and God bless you.